find anything? A few pieces from the Spirit of Vengeance. The Ashad had very specific goals in mind with that attack. I didn't expect someone following the Jedi ways to be fighting for Hedda Cole. What do you think is happening there? It's gotta be Malgus. She lost everything in that temple. Anyone would be changed. Almost anyone. True. It's always better to understand what he wants than to get in his way. Hard lesson to learn. I'm not finding anything here. Let's move on. Nothing so far. See if you can find anything on that console. Well, well. Not who I was hoping to catch. I shouldn't be surprised. Sahar mentioned she ran into you. Your attempts to question her loyalty failed. There's nothing stronger than family. Mm, you look uncomfortable. <laughs> At least I know Basque wasn't lying about the power of these sonic weapons. And hey, no hard feelings. I know there's a lot of drama between us, but that's all ancient history. But no Shay, I see. Anything to avoid her duties as Mandalore. No doubt she'll be along soon to face me. She'll stop you! She's welcome to try. Shay has always been a reluctant Mandalore, choosing to chase me rather than lead. The Mandalorians are scattered and uncertain. They could be an unstoppable force with the right leadership. And that's you! Shay's arrival was expected, but your involvement is a delicious wrinkle. You were doing so well slithering around like a jacar, and the ploy with my ships? <laughs> Clever, but I'll let you in on a secret. Warning your minions gave your little invasion away. You're different from the usual cannon fodder. I like you. So... Do I use you as bait or cut your throat? Enough! I challenge you. Face me with honor, or show your followers what you truly are. Jay. Hedda. I accept. The standard trappings are right here and now. Anytime, anywhere. Runak is a dull place. Let's give my people a show. Take her.
bring her? Any problems in transport, it's your head, Darmanda. You should have killed this one when we had the chance. No profit in doing that. I'm sure the field marshal has some grand plan. She always does. You all right? You look terrible. Shay challenged Hedda to a duel. She's been taken. A duel? Oh, of course. Okay. Listen, you remember that weird droid signal we used earlier? A new one popped up on my scanners. Led me right here. I thought you sent it, but clearly not. Shay was leaving a trail to follow. This is Hedda's base. If those two are gonna fight, it's here. Understood. Thanks for the help. I didn't get a chance to scout much out before running into your friends here, but it's big. Looks like an old military installation. Maybe a missile silo? Shielded like nothing I've ever seen. Glad I had the tech at the relay station. Now that was a fight. Once we got in, I worked on securing comms, but we were interrupted by that Varad patrol you warned us about. We threw them a bad surprise party. Akavia's searching for the ones that got away. I'm... Surprised you risked comms. I wasn't gonna let them get the jump on you. Appreciate it. I won't tell Jakai about it, though. He'd get all starchy about operational integrity or something. Oh, one more thing. I heard a lot of chatter at the relay station about a false alarm. That mean anything to you? That our ships are coming back. We don't have much time. Never do. We need to get a message to Jakaya and the fleet. Maybe he can leverage a tactical advantage if it comes to it. First things first. Right. Find Shay, shoot Hedda, and bring this whole place down. A few more of these should be a good start, right? Let's go. Hang on, let me check something. Okay, looks like I can get a message out to Jakaya through this, but it's gonna take some time. Down there is a service tunnel into the main area. It kills me, but I have to stay here and do this. Hedda's fleet can't be far away. Find Shay. I'm counting on you. Something. A weapon. One of the greatest ever created. It's been honed, tested, and delivered to devastating effect. On every one of us. The banner of Clan Kadera. Mandalore the Vindicated made us puppets of other powers. When the Kaderas resisted, he branded them traitors. My parents stood with them. For defending Mandalorian honor, they were slaughtered. This banner has been a symbol of shame for decades. A bloody reminder of what happens when you don't obey. Those who would keep us silent are the enemy. Are we not the greatest warriors in the galaxy? <laughs> Are we not worthy of forging our own destiny? <laughs> then we must fight. First, by destroying our enemy's greatest weapon. 
our obedience. Exposing their weakness. Shay Vizsla, come and face me. Gladly, pretender. Shay's in trouble. You! Well, ain't this a kick to the ships? What's going on here? Just making sure Hedda ends up on top. I got a lot riding on this. It took four of these babies to stop you. So I figured if I use just one on Shea Vizsla, the odds get much better for me. <laughs> Hedda doesn't know about this, of course. Don't want to step on her precious honor. Shut it off. Wait, wait, wait. Hear me out. If Hedda wins, I get a huge payday. Huge! You let me finish this my way, and Darmanda walks away from Hedda's pointy horns and anything to do with the hidden chain. She loses our support. You understand me? Hey, hey, I'll even sweeten the deal. Darmanda supplies your side a fat discount on weapons, supplies, whatever, for the war. Wow. Hmm. Between you and me, she ain't looking too good. You might as well get something out of this. Walk away. And that is Hedda's fleet arriving. Let me guess. Your fleet? We're out of time. Leave right now and Darmanda drops out of this and backs your side instead. So, what's it gonna be? I'm gonna even the odds. That's your idea of a fair fight? Yeah, same as mine. You're right.
just cost me a lot of credits. Never threaten me.
traitor! We got him on the run. I repeat, do not pursue. What about Hedda's fleet? We used that storm to launch an ambush of our own. It wasn't pretty, but it put them on the run. Mandalore, can you hear me? Jakaya? I'm right here. We're getting you out. Where is she? Head is gone. Hartuk. It's not over. We'll find her. You can bet on that. Just tell her, Ras. What's going on? An old enemy has crawled out of the muck. Rakan. He's the one who singled me out during the fight. I swore I'd kill him the next time I saw him. What's the story there? Two years ago, Rakan was part of a group helping the imps on Belsabis. And they were good. Experienced, skilled, all that. The Republic hired their own team to stop them. Our... Our sister Layla was in charge. There were casualties, for both sides. The imp mission failed, but Rakan escaped. Layla didn't make it. Rakan blamed us, all of Clan Ordo, for his failure. We didn't understand why a mercenary took things so personally. It's clear now. He was part of Hedda Cole's inner circle. He's responsible for losing her best people on Belsavis. He failed her, not just the mission. The more we know about Hedda and her people, the better prepared we'll be next time. Agreed. It's surprising to learn Recon has a Padawan for a sister. Never would have called that one. You'll get another chance. He can't hide behind Hedda Cole forever. Come. We should see how Mandalore fares. How's she doing? Her wounds are significant, but she is recovering. You should talk with her. I'm fine, Jakaya. I don't need a nursemaid. That's for the best. None would put up with you as a patient, great Mandalore. All of those battles have loosened your brain, as well as your tongue, wise Arbiter. Ah, uh, sorry to interrupt. We got nothing. After Hedda's fleet disengaged, they jumped. Could be anywhere. Did we find anything at the base? Not much. Those techs you ran into were happy to go through Hedda's systems, so... We'll keep searching. Hard proof aside, it's clear that Rakan's sister, Sahar, is working with Hedda. And she has a Sith relic. That can't be good. Malgus wanted it, and now Hedda has it. I need to put her in the ground before this gets any worse. News of your victory moves quickly across the galaxy. Why did you forbid me to mention the device we found? It was clearly there for Hedda to cheat. You will not mention it. Is that clear? Yes, Mandalore. I believe Hedda was not aware of the device. And while I felt the effects at the start of the duel, I am certain. Certain Hedda was the target by the end. Did you have anything to do with this? The machine hurt you. The fight could only be fair if Hedda felt the effects as well. Fair? You think this is about being fair? Hedda cheated. You needed help. You had no right to choose between death and a lifetime of dishonor. 
Hedekol and the Hidden Chain have managed to attain a victory, despite her defeat. Mandalorians must decide who they follow. This pretender's days are numbered. Nothing will stand in my way. Vizsla proved more resourceful than I anticipated. She won. With all my plans, all my preparation, she still won. This was always a test, Field Marshal. One that you passed. A secret duel on a fringe planet. This won't be a secret for long. That only helps our cause. Win or lose, you stood your ground, and Shay needed a whole fleet to rescue her. Your movement, all of this became real. Very real, yes. My base is gone, and she's victory salting my wounds. We must prepare for war, even as we retreat. I trust you will see us through. What do you propose? My sister has knowledge of a powerful new weapon. Rakan! What? Am I wrong? You hold the key. That was just between us. You promised to help me. I will. There is nothing more important to me. But this weapon, it's too dangerous. Then people with honor should control it. We both know the cost of being powerless. A weapon? Is this true, Sahar? Yes. Darth Malgus himself has his eye on it. Intriguing. Rikan. Make sure no one interrupts us. <laughs> 